Fire destroyed a house in Holyoke last month, exposing a major problem with the city's fire hydrants. 22 News I team reporter Mike Mascadrelli discovered what the city's doing to ensure what happened on Fairfield Avenue never happens again. This fire hydrant proved practically useless during that fire. The 22 News I team found out why the problem isn't so much with the hydrant, the problem lies underground. No resident of the city or business owner should ever have to worry that in the case of a fire, we're not going to have adequate water to put out that fire. A Holyoke family lost their home in a fire on Fairfield Avenue last month. Firefighters were unable to use the nearest hydrant because it couldn't supply enough water. The 22 News I team found out there are numerous hydrants that have this same issue. Holyoke's water department said there is nothing wrong with the actual hydrant here on Fairfield Avenue. It's the water mains pipes underground that are the problem. The pipes are more than 100 years old, smaller than the current standard, and have so much rust built up that the hydrant supplies significantly less water. Holyoke Mayor Alex Morris told the 22 News I team they've come up with a solution so that firefighters know exactly which hydrants have this problem. What we're working on now is making sure that the fire department has a comprehensive map and system of communication between the two departments so that they know exactly which hydrants can handle uh, a fire of that magnitude. Springfield is another city with aging water infrastructure. The Water and Sewer Commission inspects hydrants and water mains continuously and they found quite a few that need replacement. We have approximately 500 miles of water distribution main in our system so we get at it bit by bit as much as we can each year. Um, but we still have a lot of investment to make. Um, we have a, we're an old city, so it's going to take um, many years to replace it all. Fire hydrants are not only essential for firefighting efforts, they also impact the cost of your homeowner's insurance. If a hydrant is beyond the standard of 1,000 feet from your home, there's a good chance you'll pay a higher homeowner's insurance premium. But there are other factors. More of it has to do with the town that you're in and the level of protection of a town's fire department. Trudeau told the 22 News I team there are rural communities that have no hydrants at all. So firefighters are forced to bring water in from lakes and ponds. Holyoke will spend more than $6 million to upgrade old hydrants and water mains in the city. Fairfield Avenue and other historic neighborhoods are scheduled to be done first. They hope to have the entire project completed by 2023. I'm Mike Mascadrelli, working for you with the 22 News I team.